Welcome back to Project 613. Today we learn two mitzvot. We learned yesterday that it is a mitzvah to sanctify the firstborn of an animal and it has to be given as a gift to the priests. So today we have two prohibitions connected to this. Number one, that it's forbidden for the priests to eat the meat of the firstborn animal outside of Jerusalem. It needs to be eaten only in Jerusalem. And if the priest would take the meat outside of Jerusalem, he would be violating this prohibition. In addition, included in this prohibition is that anyone else but a priest is not allowed to eat the meat of the firstborn animal at all in Jerusalem or out of Jerusalem because only the priests are allowed to eat it. So that's the first mitzvah that we have today. And the second mitzvah has to do with redeeming a firstborn animal. And if you remember a while back, we spoke about that many of the offerings or the donations that are made to the Holy Temple, which are considered hectish, which have been sanctified, could technically be redeemed, which means, for example, if a person decides to donate something which has a value of 100 pounds to the Holy Temple, and then he decided, actually, I'd rather keep that object. So all he has to do is donate the value of that amount plus a certain amount of extra but you can donate the value instead of the actual item that has been dedicated but when it comes to the bechor when it comes to the firstborn which is brought as a sacrifice in the temple and is then given to the kohen to eat here the torah tells us that it is forbidden to redeem it only the animal itself has to be given the Bechor itself, the firstborn animal itself, has to be given to the Kohanim, and there is no ability to redeem it for the value or for another animal. This would not be allowed in this situation. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.